During this video you will learn how to import images in Kofax Express with Folder Scan. But first, what is Folder Scan? Usually, your document scanner is directly connected with the USB cable to your scan station running Kofax Express. But what to do with devices that are not directly connected to a PC, such as networked multifunctional copier scanners, fax servers, camera phones, etc. Well, all these devices can deliver images to a folder and from there Kofax Express can import and process them with the folder scan feature. Here are some examples of devices that can scan to a folder. Networked multifunctional copier scanners can be configured to scan to a folder by means of touch buttons on the control panel of the copier. Not really a device, but when you receive emails with attachments you can simply detach and save them in a folder for further processing with Kofax Express. Wi-Fi hand scanners can scan wirelessly to a folder on the network. You can take pictures of documents with your smartphone and save them in a folder. You can connect network production scanners for high volume document scanning. Special purpose devices such as book scanners or microfilm scanners come with the utility to scan to a folder. Imported images can be processed with all available Kofax Express functionality. That includes VRS image enhancements and automatic document separation based on barcodes, blank sheet and patch separators. Zonal OCR, barcode indexing or manual indexing are all available. And you can convert your imported images in compact searchable PDF files and export them to your document management system. Let's see how this works in practice. We will set up a job to import delivery notes scanned with a multifunctional device. I will separate and index the documents with barcodes. To import images in Kofax Express, I need to enable Folder Scan. I just select it through the Scanner Select function in the Scan Settings tab, just like any other scanner. Once selected, Folder Scan is displayed as the current scanner. I press the Setup key to configure it. First, I select the folder from where I want to import images. This is the folder where my multifunctional device scans to. We also refer to this folder as the Watched folder. I want to import all supported file types and check TIFF, PDF, JPEG and BMP file types. I can import files in chronological or in alphabetical sequence. I can create a new document for each file automatically, which is handy when importing multi-page PDF or TIFF files. Once imported, you can keep or delete the files in the watched folder. You can also leave Kofax Express in a constant watch mode and it will import as soon as an image arrives. I press OK to accept my changes and the settings are now permanently saved in my delivery notes job. I scan the sample image with my multifunctional and place it in the watched folder. I will use this image to set up VRS image processing. As you can see, I scanned in full color and did not pay too much attention to scan it perfectly straight. In the Scanner Settings tab, I select the VRS settings. I can enable Deskew, Auto Crop, Edge Cleanup, Auto Rotate and Hole Punch Removal. I can also convert a color image to a compact and highly readable black and white image. In other words, anything you can do in real time when scanning with a regular scanner, you can do during import via folder scan as well. Now that I've completely set up my delivery notes job, let's import some more images. To visualize the watched folder, I open Windows Explorer next to Kofax Express to display the content of the watched folder. It's currently empty. I scan some more delivery notes with my multifunctional and as I feed them through you see them arriving in the watched folder. I'm in a hurry and don't pay attention in putting all documents straight in the feeder. Some images are skewed, some have the wrong orientation or are scanned upside down. Notice that most documents have blank backsides except of the second document. At any moment I can press Scan All in Kofax Express to import the images. Notice how all the image enhancement and conversion to black and white happens in real time during import. Kofax Express removes blank sites but keeps the backside when it detects content. Also, the barcodes are recognized 
and the value is filled out in the delivery note index field. I can now export the delivery notes as searchable PDF files to my document imaging system. The source of the image is not so important and I can also take pictures of delivery notes with my smartphone and send them to the same watched folder. Just import and export to process them. Some special devices like book scanners cannot be directly connected to Kofax Express, but can scan to a folder. I will capture some pages from an old book with my book scanner. Each scan page appears in the watched folder. In general, it's always best to scan in color. In that way, you get ultimate flexibility in Kofax Express. For example, I can still switch back to color for the pages containing pictures. Finally, a short demo of how to process email attachments. I received an email with some invoices in PDF format. I can simply drag and drop them to my watched folder and import them with Kofax Express. As you can see, I can extract barcode data from the text-based PDF files and handle them in exactly the same way as scanned images. In summary, thanks to folder scan, any device that can scan to a folder can be used in combination with Kofax Express. And all functionality that is available when scanning with a directly connected scanner is also available for imported images. This short video only covers Kofax Express at a high level. Kofax Express features an extensive help which you can access through the Help tab. Just press the Help button and navigate to the topic you want to know more about. If you want to try out Kofax Express for yourself, visit the Kofax website at www.kofax.com and download the Kofax Express trial today.